Hello YouTube, welcome back to another video. So this one is another Alliance War in the off-season. And we've matched up against, is it G-I-R? Um, don't know very much about these at all. The main thing that I noticed in this war, especially, is that most of them didn't place. So in terms of the war video, you're going to see here, oh sorry, it's C-I-R. Um, is the war tag it's gonna be a very very short war only like four fights for me one champion that i brought in didn't even get used but off seasons like that hey you can't can't fault people for taking a full break and not even placing but yeah it normally just means that you get a nice bit of loyalty just for a bit easier and everybody's uh obviously craving that loyalty wherever they can get it so first fights this vision um vision arcus here because of the synergy between Doom and Mole Man, I believe that's the reason why the Suicides actually shrugged off me. So you see that I don't actually have them on anymore. And this fight is easy breezy, lemon squeezy with uh, Dr. Doom. And for whatever reason, he always leaves them on 1%. I don't know why it's just annoying. Why the game does it, but they're passively stunned. You give them one more love smack just to make them feel better and they drop down. We go into just like a few minutes later when I actually finally get energy to do this um, Symbiote Supreme. This one I'm just going to Red Hulk. By the time Symbiote Supreme gets to one bar of power, maybe even two bars of power at a push, he's going to be dead. Um, he's one of the defenders that's really weird to see placed, even with him benefiting from the global. Just because there's not really, without him throwing special twos that are unblockable or even a few special threes if you don't run an indestructible, that actually does some like serious and rough damage to you. Unless you're a really like buff dependent champion, then it's not really a great matchup. But you see the through the special two at the end to gain some of the suicide health back, and yeah, that was it. So the next clip in a second. I'm just going to take what's left of this Mysterio and save a couple of items here and there. And we're just going to go in for it, get him done, get out of the way. And it's going to be Dr. Doom's last fight anyway. So this node being changed uh, last season, apologies you can hear a dog barking in the background, um, is just the protection knockdown. It also has the aggressive uh, prowess. So the main plan here is not to knock them down. I activated the global there back since so now I've got to kind of wait that out. I thought I'd just give it enough time, but obviously um, I didn't time it right. I'm an idiot. Again, give me a good bash in the comments section. Let me know how much of an idiot I am. And here, I'm just trying to get it so that I can throw the special free. Here we go. Once I've knocked them down, gain the fury. Because they're only debuff immune and not stun immune, you can passively stun champions on defense. It's only if they have the actual stun immune node that you can't do that. And you're going to see there, so I can just do the full Doom Cycle with the Fury. And before I can even get a chance to throw the special one, Mysterio is in the bin. So, last fight now, Section 2. I'm just going to use Red Hulk again. Again, it's another Symbiote Supreme. This is on the Spite and Rise to Power node. So, again, I'm just going to not trigger any buffs. And just enjoy smacking into Symbiote Supreme, basically. Red Hulk doesn't mind beating on uh, beating on these Mystics when he gets the chance. And again, I'm trying to use as many different champions as I can, especially my rank 3s in the off-season, just to kind of get used to them. It's alright using them all the time in the arena or whatever, but you may as well use them in a practical sense in war every so often just to remind yourself. Here, I'm going to try and get close to the special 2 and then throw it again to regen some health. 19k, 19K crit special 2 and job's done. So that was my last fight this war. Hopefully the next war I can do a few more and put a bigger video out and uh, hopefully you'll enjoy it. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you for all the support recently and I'll catch you in the next one.